Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to my first ever public service announcement. Today, I will be performing this public service announcement to teach you all how to get the old YouTube interface back. Many people, including myself, really dislike this interface, and wish for the old one back. And guess what? We can get the old one back, and I will show you how. So, without further ado, open up two new Chrome tabs. Uh, this is, there is probably a way to do this in Mozilla Firefox and Internet Explorer and whatever browser you use, but I can't tell you for certainty. I apologize, I do not use these browsers. So, open up two Chrome tabs, send the first one to the YouTube homepage. Put the second one into your settings. Your settings can be accessed from the little top right button right under the close, the little close button in the top right. From there, go to your settings page, and you will get something that looks like this. In the bottom of it, you will see show advanced settings in blue text, also circled here. Alright, so you want to click on that, which will extend this list significantly. So you need to scroll down until you find privacy. And right under privacy, you will find content settings. Um, so, at Content Settings, you want to click on that, and you'll get the Content Settings screen. From the Content Settings screen, you need to click on All Cookies and Site Data, which will bring up a list of locally stored cookies that you have, and search in the little bar YouTube. And from there, click on YouTube.com, and then search through the list of cookies, and you'll eventually find one that is Visitor, in all caps, in underscore info one underscore live. Uh, you can see an example list of YouTube cookies that I have here. Um, and so you want visitor info one live. Click on that and you will open up the cookie info right under it. From there you will see the bunch of data related to the cookie but it's all irrelevant as you want to delete this cookie. You can do so by pressing remove. And once that's done, you've deleted the cookie, and go back out of settings, you can close that now, and open up the YouTube window, or the YouTube tab that you have. From there, press Control shift j and this will open up the console, or at least, you know, the web developer stuff. Now you may have to change to the console tab, depending on certain things. But, um... And if you go down to enter into the console, you'll see that I have here a nice little line. Document.cookie equals visitor info one live equal a whole bunch of stuff, and so on and so on. This is essentially programming in a new cookie to uh you know, the one to to replace the one that you just deleted. And boom shakalaka, you will have the old YouTube interface. If you enter this into the console, or Google Chrome that is. Um, I will leave the console and the stuff that you have to type in into the description, so that way you can simply copy and paste it into the console yourself, and you will get the new YouTube interface. So, thank you everyone for watching, and this is Kalvin, signing off.